Tennessee American Water Company crews busy today. They fielded dozens of calls. Just one of the calls they responded to came from a Chattanooga neighborhood where a water main break has residents there worried about driving conditions. Channel 3's Casey Freeman joins us with more on how this weather is causing issues. Casey. Cindy Gregg, residents on Wandale Trail say the problem started over the weekend and while the water company is aware of the situation, it could be a few more days before the break is repaired, leaving drivers to brave icy conditions. Saturday night, residents on Wandale Trail noticed water flowing from this crack in the middle of the street. That's when Janie Williams called the Tennessee American Water Company for help. A spokesperson says crews turned off the water, but they did not, leaving it spilling on the roadway. I understand, you know, it, it might be a problem with the escalation of all the pipes freezing around the city, but if we got dangerous measures, I mean, somebody need to come fix it. Temperatures never made it above freezing Sunday, leaving the roads iced over. I see a car slide on ice next to me. So I was like, okay, now it's a major problem. Neighbors are worried about their safety and sliding off the road. They also wonder who will pay for the water. But I've been running for four days straight so far. Somebody's going to be responsible for that bill. So yes, ma'am, I'm going to pay real close, close attention to my water bill. Daphne Curtsy with the water company says customer bills won't be impacted. Uh, we do not think so because we haven't had any reports on people not having water. Neighbor Jackie Heatington says this isn't the first time this type of break has happened to their neighborhood. She says leaks have appeared since November, but the cold temperatures are making the problem worse. It started right around there on Brockcliffe Way, and then it went into the curve, another line broke into the curve, and now it's right here on one deal. Kirksey tells Channel 3 crews will sand the road in an effort to keep drivers safe. Since we're having so much extreme cold weather, I don't know exactly which day we'll be able to um, make the repair. Kirksey says crews will return when temperatures warm up to make the repair. Today alone, the Tennessee American Water Company had over 50 calls reporting no water or frozen meters. They also had three active leaks earlier this evening. Live in the studio, Casey Freeman, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.